What is up, YouTube fam? Today we have a Theros Beyond Death fat pack. We are about to bust into this. And right now, the value of the cards, of course, are down because the market is being flooded with this. And everybody wants to sell all their cards. All the card shops want to sell all their cards. They want to get rid of these. You know what I mean? This dice is so cool. I just like the metallic and how big it is. It's different. I mean, just like Throne, but, you know, at least they added something really cool. So, land pack, full, full land pack. Everyone knows, promo card. There you go. I'm not going to open those. Don't steal. <laughs> All right. Let's get straight into the packs. Just to make sure. All right. Let's see how many Mythics we can get. If we can even get one. Hopefully we can get, hopefully we get like two or three, but if not, you know, it is, it is what it is. You can't, you win some and you lose some. All right. I'm not going to go over the commons. We just run over those really quick. Timer and the Chosen from Death. Miss Vision, Chair, Chamera, Chimera. Band Storyteller and ooh, Heliod Suncrown. First pack, first mythic. Easy clap, boys. And the beautiful planes there. All right. Hopefully, our, our luck just didn't run out. <laughs> We're going to see that. I'm, I'm pretty sure we'll get some good stuff in here. All right. Like I said, we're going to run through the mythics real quick. I know you guys do not want to go through the mythics like that. Soul Kraken. Staggering Insight. Re Reverent Hop Light. And Miss Unbore. Oh, <laughs> Foil Constellation. Probably not worth much because of, you know... The, the collector's booster box literally comes dies, dime, dime of a dozen with these, so. But, hey, it still looks cool. Alright. And. There you go. How are you guys liking the set? You know what I mean? Are you guys playing? Are you guys even interested in this stuff? You know? I would like to know what you guys think about the cards and stuff like that, and pretty cool and oh dream crawler i see this card going up in value this is the first one i pulled from the set so it's two dollars right now i think this is going to be at least a five dollar card it says flying lifelink whenever you draw a card dream trawler gets plus one until end of turn whenever dream trawler attacks draw a card so you you attack and then you you get the plus one so now it's a four or five flying lifelink and then discard a card. Dream Trawler gains hexproof until end of turn. So say if they want to, like, shock this or do anything like that, it's like nah, you can't do that. You can't target it. So I think it's gonna go up in value eventually once the market stabilizes from this. All right. Here we go. A glimpse of freedom. Mirror Shield, Drag of the Underworld, Temple of Enlightenment. Good card. Not a great. Oh, Foil Common, Inverted Red Burrows. Cool, cool, cool. Put that over here with the foils. Just look at these, though. Pokemon Lands. <laughs> dope, though. All right. Here we go. I think. Yeah, six packs left. This is going pretty well not too bad let's see if we can get anything good worth of value destiny spinner this card's good for for an uncommon it's got a good value that's dasa's intervention it's a beautiful island right, let's speed it up a little bit So 
soon as I see that pack doesn't want to open. <laughs> Got Thundering Chariot, the only vehicle in the set. Sculpius Maze Warden. Wolf Willow Haven. And Idolic Tutor. Beautiful card. Beautiful, beautiful card. Right there. And I think this card's worth like, I think it's $3 right now. It's dark. This card is definitely going to be a $5 to $6 card. Ooh, an Omen of the Sun. That's 3 Foils so far. And the Swamp. But we only got one Mythic. Can we make it three Mythics within four packs? I don't know. We gotta get two more Mythics. Uh, I doubt it. <laughs> but hey, we're gonna try. Okay, Commons. Underworld Dreams. Arcane of the Falling Stars. And Shadow Spear. Yes. <laughs> Pulling a lot of good rares out of this. Shadow Spear is one of the good rares. Same with Idolic Tutor. So, I mean, I'm, I honestly have nothing to complain about. These cards are all good. Temple of Enlightenment. Yeah, it's not the greatest card, but I think eventually it'll have some value. Beautiful constellation right here, non foil. The birth of Melis, rise to glory, and for the rare slash maybe mythic grave breaker, Liam, Limia. Eh, sorry, swamp. All right, down to the two packs left. Come on, Ashiok, Nightmare Muse, extended art. Where are you? That would be amazing, wouldn't it? Alright. Soul Guide Lantern. Impending Doom. Chain Web Anchor. And this is oh, another one of these, really? It's two. This fat pipe. Alright, well, headphones. Be wary. I cannot get this pack open. <laughs> oh, God. Alright. Let's go. Stinging Lionfish. Beautiful art. The Triumph of Annex. Gary. And... Temple of Enlightenment, two of those now. Beautiful. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. We got one mythic. We got, let's do this real quick. Two enlightenments. I mean, hot garbage, but the spear, idyllic tutor, titan, dream trawler. So I think value is right here. No value. No value. No value. I don't know. I would say it's worth it. You know? Well, don't give me... I got my fat pack for 30 bucks. So I don't know how you're getting your fat packs. I wouldn't... I mean, I would spend 40 bucks, I guess. I don't know how I feel about that. I got mine for 30 So, you know, just keep that in mind. There you go. Go token for the win. I'll take it easy. Love you guys. Leave a like, subscribe, comment. If you like the video, peace out.